Who is body juggling for? Wow, who's it not for? I mean, you know, who doesn't want to be connected to themselves and have control of their total body and move seamlessly with every moment? I mean, really, if you can show me that guy, I, I don't think he needs to come to class. I think everybody else, I mean, I, th I think our youngest student is four years old. Um, and our oldest uh, that I've seen on the ball is 65 and she really rocked, you know. It is structured so that anyone can do it. I mean, I've been in classes with women who were 60 years old, did not exercise, and they had a blast. People that don't like fun um, don't need to come to body juggling. People that don't like to feel don't need to come to body juggling. Everybody else, I think, you know, athletes are going to get toning and strength. Yogis are going to get flexibility. Couch potatoes are going to find energy they didn't know they had. Spiritualists are going to find a, a real, a true, a tangible connection to this idea of spirit and mind and, and soul that you can't get reading any book or talking to any group. But really when it comes down to it, it's about what are we experiencing? What do we really what do we really know through our own experience? One of the most important lessons in body juggling is the learning how to fall, you know, and the learning how to catch yourself and becoming soft when you fall. And in any sport, you need to know how to fall. That's the first lesson. Well, the main thing that's different about this is that it allows me to be able to learn how to, you know, balance my body more and also be able to use my body in different directions. Because most of the time when I'm doing, you know, different types of exercises, it's either front, back, left or right. This one, it allows you to be able to do more in a circular motion. And so that's what makes it a little bit more interesting and also a little more challenging. I live a very traditional life. And so Satek is a very wonderful addition to my life. He's brought a lot of things that I would have never, ever gone out and experienced. But he is magical in that he's so open and he's so loving and he, you know, is so non-judgmental about life and he's seeking that, you know, whatever he can do to make changes to himself and to help other people. It's really a pretty amazing thing. He's hilarious and wise at the same time. And I think that's a great combination. I think what he brings to the body juggling class is kind of like a, an energy, a vibe that, you know, you're not here just to follow directions. You're here to learn something about yourself, uh, learning, you know, something about, you know, how you move. It could be a fun partner, a sport or art, because um, you can do poses together and balance on each other and use one another's weights. Qigong was the first time I tangibly could feel energy as a substance, as something as real as my body. And everything I've done since then has involved energy in some way, because at that point I realized everything is this, everything is just energy, everything is vibration, and energy is always moving, it's always flowing. And as I began to get deeper in that through yoga, through kundalini, through Qigong, I began to realize that all of my problems were just blockages of energy in some capacity, whether it's physical, whether it's mental, emotional, thoughts, whatever it is, it's just blockages of that energy. So as you learn to relax into the flow, and that's all it takes to feel flow, to feel the presence of your own self, is to just relax. Once you do that, your, your problems literally dissolve. They just, they, they, Every, it's like rotor rooter for the soul, you know, it just, it just moves, it just moves. I love body juggling just because it makes you feel like you're eight years old again. You know, it's kind of like when you go skipping, it brings back all those childhood memories, and that's what body juggling does. I really love being able to push myself a little bit and being able to get, get to a place where I can actually really do something a little bit different that I hadn't done before. And that's what I really, I really love about this place. I'm sitting on a ball, and body juggling is way fun. <laughs> but it's more just a, a relaxation technique because it forces you to be aware of every little nuance that you're doing. So that to me is the most important thing is just becoming, use it as a tool to become more relaxed.